The Neferi is a pair of dual daggers that becomes available for grinding and purchase from the in-game marketplace once you finish the new war. In this video we'll only look at the weapon, so it won't contain any quest spoilers. The Neferi has the highest base damage of all dual daggers, and deals around 35% innate heat damage, with slash damage in second place. It also has the highest range of all dual daggers, and it's tied for second highest speed. Its critical chance is 21%, which gives you just over 100% critical chance with Bloodrust at combo counter 12. Its critical multiplier is 2.3 times, and it has a high status chance of 33%. The stance polarity matches Spinning Needle. Since I would say that this is the best stance for dual daggers, and I don't have a spare stance forma to test Gnashing Peura, I'll stick with Spinning Needle for this video. This stance has a high damage per second in general on all combos, and two forced slash procs on the neutral, non-blocking combo. Notably, the heavy attack also inflicts two forced slash procs with each dagger. Additionally, the Neferi has a special neutral, non-blocking combo attack, which shoots four fireballs as part of the second combo hit. The fireballs have a range of 19 meters, and deal around 50% of the regular attack's damage, spread over four fireballs. The fireballs have enemy punch through, apply a forced impact proc and have a high chance to inflict heat procs. The Neferi has one innate V polarity, and I've added three more. You should be fine with just two for the regular combo viral build. Despite the fact that I like the fireball gimmick, this weapon works better if you use it sparingly. The fireball throwing animation makes the neutral combo a lot slower than other combos, I find it better to use the regular moving combo and blocking neutral combo. Since the heavy attack on dual daggers inflicts forced slash procs, a heavy attack build also isn't a bad idea. I've found that this one doesn't work too well against big groups of enemies, but it does work decently against the Acolytes. And lastly, I have a slash focused build, with high critical damage and a primed smite mod instead of viral damage. The Primed Smite mod increases the damage over time both from Slash procs and Heat procs. This build works very well against higher level heavily armored targets, and you can inflict viral procs either with a Primer, or a Panzer Vulpaphyla. So I do think that the Neferi is a great weapon, good both for general use and higher level content. If you want to spam fireballs, attack speed buffs will help a lot. Due to its high critical multiplier, critical chance buffs either from Arcane Avenger or Kavats are also a good idea.